Hey everybody, my name is Kitamo, welcome back for another video of Horizon Forbidden West. We're gonna continue this series, boys. Right back where we last left off. I think I can probably go up from here. There we go. Easy enough, boys. We're supposed to go uh, up and up all the time. Now, yeah, there's a path through here. I see the, the yellow stuff, so I'm gonna follow that. I think I'm probably supposed to drop to that side. There we go. And just like that. Alright, so we're going up. Moving up. Towards uh, Gerald's uh, location right there. Hopefully, uh, we're going to be fine. And hopefully, we're going to be able to save Beta. And stop them uh, from doing whatever they, they're trying to do that's super evil and stuff. So, let's try and do that, boys. Let's try and stop them. I'm getting a lot of loot right here. Something tells me they're anticipating a, we're anticipating kind of a big boss fight or something. Another boss fight. Just killed Eric in the last video. If you guys didn't miss uh, miss the last video, go ahead and check it uh, before this one. Very important. Me, big boss fight and stuff. Very important. Well, I can see where the console was at least. Got you, my girl. Look, I know you've been through a lot, but you have to help me access the Zenith network. I need to see their files, anything referring to the word Nemesis. Okay. O over there. The systems are down all over the base. I should be able to take advantage of... Yes, Nemesis. There's something in deep space. It's following the Zenith to Earth. Look. Escape vectors. Alva tried to warn me about this. The Zeniths aren't planning to stay here. It's a machine of some kind. Or a swarm of them. The energy readings are astronomical. Aloy, I don't think a natural disaster destroyed the Zenith colony on Sirius. This thing did. Earth isn't a new home for them. It's a way station. They're on the run. I, uh, I, that's a big entry you did for us right there. Big ass entry. I guess he's dead now? Just like that. I was expecting a boss fight, but I guess not. I see you've been busy. And you've been lying. Nemesis, what is it? It is us. The minds of Far Zenith. Or failed copies of them anyway. Back on Sirius, some of my peers weren't satisfied with physical immortality. They wanted digital transcendence. A way to upload their minds into any form, organic or mechanical. Nemesis was a failed experiment to that effect. Abandoned, but never erased. An immense database of our memories, emotions, and prejudices left to fester. And it destroyed your colony? We didn't realize it had gained sentience until it broke containment. It had everything it needed from our memories. Security protocols, system specs, override codes. It hacked everything before we knew what hit us. Then it took over our printing facilities, allowing it to gain any machine form it needed to wipe us out. But why? Imagine being trapped alone for decades with only the twisted echoes of megalomaniacs for company. It hates us for abandoning it to that prison. And now that it's free, it will do anything to destroy us. Including denying us a safe harbor on Earth. The extinction signal that woke Hades. You didn't send it. Nemesis did. Finally. 
And when that failed, it launched from Sirius to finish the job itself. Which is why we must flee to a random planet circling a random star somewhere it can never find us. With Gaia, so you can build yourself a new world. That's the plan. Even now. Earth is finished, Aloy. Nemesis will scour it of life to deny its creators a viable home. But Elizabeth's dream won't die. You'll come with me to the stars. And with Gaia, we'll create a new world. Together. Where that monstrosity could never find us. What? No. I loved Elizabeth. More than you could ever know. And I let her stay behind to die with the rest of humanity. A mistake I have regretted for a thousand years. Now she stands before me again. Not some inferior copy, but her best possible self. So I'm not asking. You're coming with me. It may seem harsh now, but you'll forgive me in a few centuries. You can't force me, Tilda. Your shield is gone. I have something better. Spectre Prime, to me. Take cover! Get to the door! The men hate the way. You can't win. No! Oh, really now? What a surprise! She was this evil the entire time. Like, it's not a surprise that. whatsoever. Like, the I've evil twirly, uh, mustache twirly uh, villain right there. No! It's literally what she is just an evil twirly mustache villain. I mean, I guess. I guess it can work. Okay. You know what? That's enough. Um, how about. Okay. Chill out, man. Holy shit. Gonna, let me put some traps in there, please. Stop annoying me. Get, put the trap. There we go. So now... Okay. Uh, she's not coming towards me. That's not good. Uh, we need to... Uh, I need to do the... Uh, whoa. I need to do the advanced blast trap. So when she comes towards me... Get another trap right here. Oh, you shitting me. She put the trap against me. I'm going to have to put a bunch of traps somewhere. She's coming towards me sometimes, but not all the time. It's kind of frustrating, boys. I'm not going to lie. It is very frustrating. I just want her to uh, to come fight me. Come fight me. Come on. Come up. Come, there we go. Come fight me like that. Come into, uh, towards my traps, my girl. Come towards my traps. Come on. You got this. Come towards me. There we go. Coming towards my trust, boys. It seems to be working. There we go. I don't know how I'm going to beat her. This is literally the final boss right there. Uh, I don't have the enough energy to do the thing. So, Are you going to come towards me? Or... Oh, okay. She's just going to do that. Great. There we go. Just like that. Answer that rolls again. Just got to keep attacking her with that, boys. Okay, good. Now she's, uh, she's done for. There we go. And again, equip, equip that. There we go. A little bit of damage that way. There we go. There we go, boys. Now we're doing a lot of damage. We're doing some damage at least. It's annoying though. She's really annoying to fight. Not gonna lie. She's really annoying to fight, boys. There we go. Get her. Now she's gonna do the so same much. attacks over and over again. Again. Well, My arrows, I don't have unlimited arrows though. It's gonna be a problem. If I have to continue to craft some more arrows all the time, it's gonna become a problem. There, get her, there we go. Get her. Damn it. I'm gonna have to heal myself. Is there anything that can heal me right here? So nearby? I mean, got, got some stuff. Okay, they're giving me... They're giving me stuff for advanced blast and stuff. And that's protecting me. So at least there's that. I mean, there's some stuff protecting me, I guess. I'm gonna just do that really quick. There we go. Get it. There we go. Get it again. There we go. All right. So now I got this ability again. Got it. Got it again. 
Again, there we go. Do as much damage as possible. I'm gonna uh, activate my power shot. I'm gonna need it. I'm gonna need my power shot, boys. Get it. There we go. Power shot activated. Uh, I, at the same time, I'm gonna do this. There we go. Do another one of those things right here. There we go. Okay, so now I need her to come towards me and not shoot. There we go. That's what I want her to do, boys. Boom. All right, there we go. That's going to do a little bit of damage. Get another uh, another trap right there. Again, come towards me, my girl. Okay, no, she's going to do her thing right here. So she's going to do a bunch of range weaponry. I don't have my power shot anymore. I'm going to have to attack her. Attack her as much as possible, boys. With the acid arrows. Acid arrows are allowing me to do more damage when it's fully equipped. Okay, I am going to need another one right here. I'm going to need another one of those. And I have to heal, uh, heal myself up as well. Come towards me if you can. Come on, my girl. I know you want to. Come on, man. Stop messing around. I'm going to have to go put a bunch of ice arrows. I don't have enough uh, arrows for that. Get it? There we go. Every time. Just got to work through it, boys. Work through it. There we go. Again. There we go. Again. There we go. Now. Here comes the part where it's very important to attack her as much as possible in the weak points. I'm just going to keep uh, freezing her. Keep freezing her really quick, boys. Until we get uh, better options right here. I'm going to keep doing the same abilities. Get her. Oh, there's some... Okay, what is that? What, is those, what are those things right here, boys? Get it. There we go. And get it. There we go. Again. Okay. All right. We're good, we're good, we're good, boys. Froze her, froze her again. Come on, That's surely we can freeze her. There we go, she's frozen, boys. Now, here comes the, the part where I, I need to use that. Now we're doing a lot of damage from that. We're doing a lot of damage, boys. We're getting her. Get her. Get as much damage as possible. That's what I'm talking about right here. Last time, last time, we got her. That's, uh, that's done, we're done with her. She's done for, boys. We defeated her. Took a lot. It took a lot of, uh, of thinking, a lot of strategy in order to defeat her, but managed to do it in the end. She was definitely a lot tougher than Eric, that's for sure. But one thing I don't like, though, about her is the fact that she was just another twirly villain. Twirly mustache villain. I, don't, I did not like that whatsoever. That was just kind of cringe at the same time. A little bit, boys. I'm not going to lie. All right, so I've got unused uh, coils and weaves, but there's a cutscene, so I'm not going to be able to use those. She tried to take you. And she told you about Nemesis. So you've known all along. From Hades, yes. Along with data on how to circumvent the Zenith shields. Everything I did to create the rebel army was based on that knowledge. To reach this place, this moment. And you couldn't just tell me? Come now, Aloy. You're the last person to act sensibly in the face of impossible odds. When I learned of Nemesis from Hades, I saw the pieces on the board and how to play them. And in that same moment... I knew it was a game you would never play. That you would interfere and attempt to save the Tanakhd. I was correct, to a point. You ruined my plans, but brought your own to fruition. The end result is the same. We're here. And now it's time for me to leave this doomed planet behind. To seize the Odyssey and the Apollo database. And begin a new chapter in my pursuit of knowledge, one with infinite possibilities. You can join me if you so desire. You've more than earned your place. Unlike Tilda, I'm extending a polite invitation. You're going to just take off and abandon everything? Stay. Help me fight that thing. Perhaps Tilda didn't adequately define the threat. Nemesis can't be stopped. 
It destroyed a highly advanced Zenith colony in a matter of hours. What hope does this primitive tribal Earth have? If you brought Gaia, you wouldn't be abandoning life. You'd be saving a seed for a new world. Just as Elizabeth did. It's the choice she made. The sacrifice of all that is for the hope of what might be. If she were here in your place, she would board that shuttle, Aloy. Found her. Is she hurt? She's still on her feet. Thank the turn. Goodbye, Silence. She looks okay. She looks victorious. As always. Eloy. You did it. Hey, where's he going? As far away as anyone can go. Oh. Are you sure? You're staying. For a time. You people are going to need all the help you can get. Uh, does anyone else need a drink? Not if it's that ale of yours. Uh, <laughs> I'd be fine with a nap. <laughs> Excellent idea. Uh, I hope it's really over this time. There's another battle ahead, Elizabeth. Very different than the one you fought. It's not about the distant hope of creating a new world. It's about preserving the one we have. My friends have a new mission. To spread the word and ask for help. They've taken it in stride. I think it's because they've always known what I've only just started to understand. That the people of this world have the strength to fight any battle. the ingenuity to solve any problem. The courage to overcome any obstacle. And the resilience rise after any setback. As for me, I can't say I'm not afraid. What lies ahead will be harder than anything we've faced before. But I know I can put the fear aside. Because for the first time in my life, I feel like I'm not alone. Alright, we've finished the game, boys. It's over.
that's it right there our 26 is over so a uh, pretty interesting game I mean I wasn't much of a fan of it uh, I never played the first one the second one wasn't much of anything really uh, to be honest not a lot of options really uh, and I would have liked to see a lot more of the sun gods and everything right I would have liked to the sun king and everything I would have liked to see more of those uh, we barely saw anything on the surface of them uh, they didn't really explain anything. I imagine they were really prominent in the first game, but a second game we saw them for two seconds and then we were like, well, oh, fuck it. We're not going to see them again. It's kind of a uh, very interesting. There's not a whole lot. Uh, this game was, I don't know, about average, about average of a game. Uh, was it worth the price? I'm not sure, boys. I don't think it was worth the price, but you know, not not a lot of games are actually worth 80, 90 bucks nowadays. So I'm not like, I, I'm not sure, boys. I, I mean, I would have paid it, played it for 60 bucks, but not 90. But it's a decent game, I guess. Uh, not sure if I would recommend it, but if you guys do enjoy this, did enjoy the first game, I guess you're gonna enjoy the second game. Uh, not much of a difference here. It's a decent game overall. So, um, I guess the next series, I already know what I want to do. Uh, remember, boys, I, I was trying a long time ago to come back to Star Wars The Old Republic. But I couldn't because of my old PC. But now I have my brand new PC, so I'm actually going to be able to come back uh, to uh, the Star Wars Old Republic. We're going to be able to come back, make our huge comeback and everything. It's going to be super fun. So that's going to be my next series. That's going to be um, after this one. So remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy uh, this Let's Play. I'll see you guys for the next one. Keep it easy.